I've always thought that having a boyfriend would be super exciting. <sighs> Who wouldn't want to experience her first love at 14 years old? I bet very few wouldn't, unless, of course, you've been with your boyfriend for one year and he still hasn't kissed you yet. What? I met John last summer at a camp. And if you think that I'm some crazy harasser forcing him to go out with me, you're totally wrong. In fact, it was him the one who asked me out. I was too shy to even think about it. And even though at first I didn't feel a special interest towards him, um, with time I grew fond of him and the sparks did fly. As I also was his very first girlfriend, at first everything was a bit awkward. It was difficult to talk to each other without blushing and we didn't know very well what we should be doing. Should we hold hands? We took months to take that step. And because of my insecurities, I wasn't in a rush to know what having my first kiss would be like. I mean, on the lips, of course. He had already kissed me on the cheek, like two or three times. The thing is that I wasn't obsessed with that, but I couldn't just forget about it either. It had to be something super romantic, right? But in the end, my shyness was stronger than me and I was okay with just spending time with him. That was at first, of course, but when we celebrated our first anniversary, something clicked inside of me. I could understand that I was very shy, but also him? During all this time, he never even tried to give me a kiss like in the movies and my mind started racing. Maybe he didn't like me anymore? You're my favorite person, he would tell me. So that couldn't be the issue. In fact, he treated me incredibly well. I tried to not give it much importance, but for me, it was important. I started getting surlier with him because every time I would get close to him looking for that intimate moment, he would move away until one day everything exploded. It was on his birthday. He organized a small party at his house with our friends. His parents weren't home, so that was the perfect opportunity for me. I gathered all my courage and waited until I was alone with him. We were chatting when I jumped on his lips. The kiss was horrible, maybe because he didn't expect it or because none of us had any experience. But that wasn't the worst part, it was his face of disgust. He gently pulled me away while I turned red like a tomato. He said, I think this isn't right. What isn't right? What isn't right? Was it wrong to kiss your boyfriend after one year together or what? I didn't understand anything and I felt like crying. When he saw the sad expression on my face, he tried to explain himself. No, it's not that. I do like you a lot, but I think I'm not prepared for this. What I mean is, um, kisses and things like that. He kept going with his explanation. He told me that it had nothing to do with me and that it's just how he felt towards that kind of approach. He thought it was weird too, but he read on the internet about it and found out there were other people just like him. People who didn't need kissing or touching and he was happy just spending time with me. His words fell on me like a bucket of ice cold water. What was he saying? That he would never kiss me? That I had to accept him for who he was? Because that seemed to be his conclusion. I felt so frustrated and confused that the only thing I could think of was getting out of his house. What do you guys think I should do? Either way, my life sucks. Does your life suck as well and you want to share it with us? Send us your story to storiesmylifesucks at gmail.com and don't forget to follow us on social media to find out if you are the protagonist of our next video.